Welcome to Snail Trail 4x4. Today we're discussing shop gloves. A quick little preview of the shop gloves that I've used in the past. I've got the latex ones that everybody has. You know, I use these quite a bit um, just for oils and things of that way, that nature to keep my hands clean. I've got these that I've used for a long time that are just rubberized. They're super stretchy. They just, they're, they're bulky and they don't fit very great, but um, they're great for when I get have dirty projects. Um, these are the newest ones I've been using. Uh, the uh, mechanics gloves, they are got a full leather palm, very breathable. I also have these big boys that are uh, have super grip on one side. They've got a put, big old pull tab they've, and they've got some uh, protection for your joints and your hand. But my favorite by far are these mechanics gloves that I've been using lately. Uh, let's put two minutes down on the clock and I'll tell you about them. Boom. Uh, the cool thing I like about these mechanics gloves is that they're very breathable and they fit my hand really well. And I think that's probably the priority for a good shop glove is just a good fit. So, you know, I would suggest checking these guys out. But if these don't fit you well, I would continue to look and find a shop glove that would fit you well. Um, they've got great breathability on this end because it's all mesh on this side. On the other side, it's full leather, the whole entire palm. It's not super thick leather, so you can grab things really easily. I um, One of the things I really enjoy about these is that I have some good feel through the glove, and I can reach up and I can undo or put in bolts with gloves on. Sometimes that's really tricky. Um, they've also got a soft um, side here that's very breathable and stretchy right by the thumb. And so that makes for a good fit for your hand. And that's a lot of the movement comes from that area of your hand and trying to reach in and grab things. Uh, the leather from the bottom side will wrap up and around on the fingertips. So just to give you a little bit more protection there. It does it on four of the, fi um, the fingers except for the pinky. Uh, it also has a big grip all, all in this palm area. It comes all the way up into here. I'm not sure exactly the, the best feature for that, but it does you know gives you a little bit more protection this is the only glove i've been using lately also that has a full strap that'll wrap around so you can tighten it on your wrist um, so that it won't slide off and it doesn't move and it holds it very well in place so i really enjoy these mechanics gloves i hope you do too i'll put a link down in the description for them um, an amazon affiliate link but i would probably suggest you go into your local auto parts store and check it out and find out what fits your hand the best. Um, I, like I said, I've really been enjoying these gloves. Uh, so I would suggest trying these guys first and then going off to find some other ones. But do what's best for you. Thanks for watching this episode of Snail Trail 4x4. Put a comment below and let me know if there's any features or any items that you want me to specifically talk about. Hammer down on that subscribe button and don't forget, keep crawling. Snail Trail 4x4!